Hi, Dan Cox. I'm backstage here, King of this King of the Cage. I'm with uh, Kenya Sisan. She is the winner of the fight with Chelsea Fowler. Um, an unfortunate disqualification. I have to say, this was one hell of a fight. Uh, Kenya was delivering from round one on. She did win that first round. Some vicious ground and pound. How, how did you feel out there? I felt great. I thought it was fun. Um, we were having a war. Chelsea is you know like a lot stronger than I anticipated for how small she is um, I could I had trouble taking her down um, I had trouble with her stand up but I was able to pop that jab in there and hurt her a little bit and had, I had some good kicks um, I'm proud of myself I have a lot to learn um, as far as stand up goes I have some bad habits that I need to get back in the gym and um, try to take care of that but uh, I felt really good. I felt good about the first round. The second round could have went either way. But you know, it's, I just I, I'm really disappointed that I had to win by disqualification. Um, I'm really surprised. Not really surprised because her and her team are kind of like low class. I feel like, and they're not very professional. And um, they've been bullying me the whole time, so this isn't really a big surprise to me, but it's still disappointing because I wanted to win fair and square. I wanted to win on my own. I wanted to, to, I wanted to win in the first round with that ground and pound. I felt like they should have stopped the fight because there was, um, what, 40 unanswered shots? A lot. 50 unanswered shots. I mean, come on now. But anyway, you, I feel good. You have nothing to feel bad. You should be proud because you came in there and she brought it. She came in to fight. She came in to finish the I fight. I'm not going to quit ever. I will not quit. And she knew that. She felt that I wasn't going to quit. She was slowing down. She yeah. was going to quit. And she was going to lose. And she went dirty with it. And I still won. So thank you for that win money, Chelsea. This was the Terminator. I've got to say, she continued yeah, to come forward. It. it looked like Chelsea really had an adrenaline dump in that first round. And after that, you just continue to move forward. I thought you guys yeah. both left it in the cage. I have nothing but respect for you. Again, this was a great fight, you guys. It always sucks to have something end this way, but this is a warrior right here. Don't doubt that, and thank you so much for the time. Thank you so much. Any shout outs to friends, teammates, sponsors? Yes, I would like to um, shout out to my gym, uh, Shift MMA, my coach, Andrew Peterson, all my teammates, my sponsors, Fahrenheit Massage has been amazing. Um, Okemos Pediatric Dentistry for my awesome mouth guard. Simplis 1-2-Tan, they've been with me from the start. I've got awesome sponsors and awesome people that were here supporting me and I love them so much. I'd like to shout out to my kids. I have three children that are amazing and beautiful and they're always in my heart and they're the ones that drive me to do this. And I mean, I'm just, I just, you know, I have a lot of people and I just love them dearly and I'm just so thankful that I was at, I was able to pick up the win tonight even though it was kind of a stupid way to win. I don't I don't like that. But anyway, you know, you fought fight. you fought your ass off. Good time. Is the sponsors are incredible because that's what allows athletes uh, like Kena to get in there and do what she does. Thank you for taking the time after this. And again, nothing but respect for this woman. This is a warrior for sure. Check her out, guys. We'll see you next time.